Shalom everyone, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Family, wherever you are, I hope you are doing well. God bless you so much. If today is your first time, I kindly ask you to subscribe to the channel Shalom Studies. Go to YouTube and click the notification bell and leave a message. Please leave a message and let me know what how the channel has been a blessing to you. Let me know what is happening in your life. God bless you so much. Family, I thank you so much for being part and being patient with me. I've been off for some time, but I'm back. God bless you. Now, today I will share with you another important aspect of nature with you. But before that, let's go into the Word of God. Let's go to Psalm 91. I would like you to open your Bible, Psalm 91, verse 12 to 15. <clears throat> verse 12 to 15 he said the righteous will flourish like a palm tree they will grow like a cedar of Lebanon planted in the house of the Lord they will flourish in the courts of our God verse 14 they will still bear fruit in their old age they will stay fresh and green Proclaiming the Lord is upright. It is my work and there is no wickedness in him. So I don't think God created anything for our destruction. Whatever God created, the nature, the natural thing that God has created is for our own benefit. So today I'm going to talk to you about something, some part of the palm tree, which some of us especially those of us in africa we have seen it we throw them away we don't know their use but after today teaching you will value it you value it it's, it's on top of the palm tree people normally don't regard it they don't respect it they only go for the nuts and yet they just throw it away but the mystery about the palm tree I told you there is nothing on the palm tree that can be thrown away. Everything. Everything, it has only two functions. It's for food and for medicine. Food and medicine. The palm tree. Now God said, God related us to the palm tree. Meaning our life is not supposed to be wasted. We are not supposed to to waste our life. Our lives are not supposed to waste it. Some of you, the enemy is wasting your life. The enemy is attacking you. The enemy is on your neck. But this simple uh, element will help you to get back on track. What am I talking about? This particular leaf. If you have seen it, wave, wave, wave to me. If you have seen it and you know it, wave to me at the comment section very very powerful i i grew up seeing my mom burning it and when i ask her i ask her she's like it chases away mosquito i don't know whether she knew what she was doing or she was just doing it but now that I've grown and gained understanding, I know its spiritual benefit, its spiritual empowerment. If you have been throwing this particular thing away, you have wasted many years. You have wasted many resources. From today, value it, cherish it. It is very, 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 very powerful. This leaves is called palm rasta or african incense palm rasta or african incense very 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 powerful now you can combine it with frank incense you combine it with frank incense and you'll be on top of life you'll be on top of yourself you will enjoy it it does not only chase away mosquito but it chases away spiritual mosquitoes also. It chases away spiritual insects, spiritual bacteria, spiritual enemies. Burn it in your house. Burn it in your house. You can burn it inside. Then when you finish, 
place it in the compound of your house. If there are any witches around you, surrounding you, who have been monitoring you, they will disappear. They will not be able to stand. Now, it's spiritual benefits. If you are someone who has been suffering from cobwebs, 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 they are always entangling in your face. You'll be even daytime you are walking, you see them binding you on your face. Anytime such things happen, it means there is a monitoring spirit monitoring you. And when that happens, they take information from you. And the cobwebs normally, normally where they attack is your face. Now, another, another thing you can use, I, have, I wanted to teach about it, but let me bring in. If you have been facing that particular cobweb attack, wake up from midnight, from 12 to 3. That midnight urine, that midnight urine, collect it and use it to wash your face. Then go back to bed. That cobweb will, will stop. Urine is a medicine. It's good for toothache. It's medicine. Don't use somebody's urine. Use your own urine. Use your own urine. Use it to wash your face. As you wash, say, I disconnect every cobwebs. I remove it. Believe me. Try it and come and give me the results. It's very, very powerful. You can use either way. So if you have soft, if you have been, been attacked by cobweb, it, it can attack you from your workplace, from your home, even you are walking in town and there's nothing that shows that there should be cobwebs, you see them coming. They will just come attack you. These are demonic instruments they use to monitor, to attack their victims. What you can do, pick one of it. It's very strong. Or you can pick three of them or two of them break it into pieces combine it with your frankincense if you don't have frankincense i sell them you can make an order i sell them combine them combine it with your frankincense get charcoal burn it let stay in the room close the door incense yourself as you do that you pray using psalms chapter 2 Pray using Psalms chapter 2. God deliver me. Break every chain, every notch, every witchcraft monitors monitoring me. Break them away. You can burn it in your office. You can burn it in your home. You, it's purifier. It's a spiritual purifier. Now, one thing about the palm tree, as I told you, nothing is wasted. And God related us to the palm tree. So when you do, you burn it, you are asking God to restore you in relation to the palm tree. That from today, your life should be useful. Your life should be meaningful. There should be progress in your life. Now, this one also, this put away witchcraft attack. It chases away evil spirits in your surrounding. So as you are burning it, you are purifying your house. If your house is big, three bedroom house, put it in your bedroom, bring it in the sitting room, even the toilet, in the bathroom. Make sure every place, every part of your home is incensed. Do it with the frankincense. Purify your home. Now, uh, the best part is this. After the burn, let the charcoal and the incense cool down. The following morning, the ash of this with the with the frankincense collect them pick some and put them in your body lotion put it in your body lotion or your body cream and be smearing it every morning every every morning as you go out you go to office smear it on your body what you are doing is god i close every witchcraft eyes every demonic entities every monetary spirit every cobwebs I close them. I disconnect myself from them. You smear it in your body. It is a spiritual weapon for protection. This thing that you see here. Very, very powerful. Go and look for it and use it. It deals with witchcraft. It deals against witchcraft also. 
God bless you so much. Shalom.